The next problem is integration of x sin 3x dx. So here again we have two functions x and sin 3x. These two functions are in multiplication. We already know when we have two functions in multiplication, we use integration by parts. So when you have two functions f of x and g of x in multiplication and you have to integrate it, the formula is f of x into integration of g of x dx minus integration of integration of g of x into differentiation of f of x dx. So you have to remember this formula by now. And you should also know how to select the first function and second function. Whenever you have a function of the form x raised to n, we make that our first function. Here also, we will make f of x as x and g of x as sin 3x. Now we can put everything back in the formula and get our solution. So, integration of x sin 3x dx can be written as first function that is x into integration of second function that is sin 3x dx minus integration of integration of sin 3x dx into differentiation of first function. So, differentiation of x is 1 and we will write dx. Now, here you have to integrate sin 3x. If you don't know how to integrate this, you have to go and check out the videos on integration by substitution. So, we put 3x as y and we integrate this. So, integration of sin 3x will be minus cos 3x upon 3 minus integration of integration of 3x dx which will be minus cos 3x upon 3 into 1 that is this whole term and dx. Check out the videos on integration by substitution if you don't know how to integrate these terms. Now, we have to integrate further. So, first term will be minus x by 3 cos 3x minus into minus will become plus integration of we can take 1 by 3 outside integration. So, you get 1 by 3 integration of cos 3x dx. Now, we will integrate cos 3x just like we integrated sin 3x. We will use integration by substitution. So, we can write finally as minus x by 3 cos 3x plus 1 by 3 integration of cos 3x will be sin 3x upon 3 plus c. We can take the constants together and finally write minus x by 3 cos 3x plus sin 3x upon 9 or we can write 1 by 9 sin 3x plus c. This is our final answer that is integration of x sin 3x dx is minus x by 3 cos 3x plus 1 by 9 sin 3x plus c. I hope you understood how we have used integration by parts to solve this problem. Keep practicing. Let's meet in the next video.